Every month at the new moon, we begin a new emotional cycle, and we have the opportunity to reset our goals and intentions. The new moon in Libra is October 12th at 8.05 p.m. Libra is an air sign in the cardinal modality, and it's dealing with intellectual energy. It's very oriented to relationships and connecting with others. Let's examine this complex pattern of planets. First, the Sun and Moon in Libra will be opposite Uranus in Aries, and that's very dynamic. That speeds everything up, and that also creates sort of an us versus them mentality. So I think what this is really saying is it's time to meditate on your negotiation skills. The Uranus and Aries energy is focusing on individualism and making sure you get your needs met. But the Sun and Moon in Libra are very focused on cooperation, compromise, and focusing on the other person's feelings and understanding where the other person is coming from. So this is an important time to learn the art of negotiation with power. Taking a stance, holding your position, and sensing the other person's needs, staying pleasant, and not going into attack mode. The other thing about this new moon that is very important to understand is that we have three planets in Virgo. We have Venus, Mars, and Jupiter working together in Virgo, and those planets are opposite Neptune, and they form a wide square to Saturn. That dynamic is really boldly shouting out to us about humility, about compassion, and about finding the perfect balance in how to do that practically in the world, forming a plan that works. We have had so much energy in the last year revolving around ego, revolving around dynamic levels of confidence as Jupiter transited Leo and then Mars transited Leo recently also. Well, now it shifts. It's a little bit more humble and it's definitely more sincere. And it says, release your pride and form a new way to communicate with others so that it is very compassionate and sincere and practical at the same time. It's a big switch right now and this new moon brings all of this into focus. So what I recommend that you do is hold your ground in what you want in life and tap into all that heart energy and be loving and compassionate and communicate with other people from the place where you understand that they are a learning, growing soul. Remember, you're blending idealism, compassion, practicality, and negotiation all together. So enjoy this new moon in Libra. Thank you. I'm Kathy Rose.